Although today is my 40th birthday, I don't feel that old. I'm going climbing the tallest indoor wall in the world. I admitted that I was not expecting this to be so hard. I reached like 20 something meters, not the 55. Uh, maybe when I reach 41, but it just shows that I need, I need to practice a lot more. I'm done, I, it's even hard to hold this. <laughs> How do you think I behaved in the first climbing session? First one? We thought you were gonna top it. So. Yeah, I blame it on the age. Too, you, too many years. You didn't warm up. Waiting. <laughs> I didn't warm up. Figured that it's such a tall wall that I'm gonna warm up on the way up. No, That's not, not true. what happened. <laughs> My arms are completely busted by halfway. This. Cheers, me. Today I took a beating. I was pretty convinced I was gonna flash the whole thing, like 55 meters. It was supposed to be an easy thing, it's inside the shopping mall, right? And it wasn't that easy actually, it was pretty tough. I bombed it big time, I made like what, 25, best case scenario, 30 meters. My shoulders were really pumped. I, I did a lot of rookie mistakes to be honest, like I didn't, I didn't warm up properly. I just decided to start climbing, I was so, you know, full of adrenaline, I really wanted to see how far could I go? And that was a big mistake. After that, we went to uh, bed at the gym. I'm, I'm exhausted. I can feel my age weighting me down. I guess I need to be a little bit more careful about what I eat. Me and my wife, we had great plans for my 40th birthday. I was planning to go to Macau or even Las Vegas, you know, to have some crazy fun for a couple of days. COVID destroyed all those plans. I ended up alone, away from my family, away from my wife, who are still stuck in Portugal. I'm alone in Shanghai.